What do we know about low-income households? For example, someone working full-time for $7.25 an hour, grad students teaching part-time, or retired people living on a pension. Well, the U.S. Census collects demographic data about the person who owns, rents, or maintains a housing unit, which they call a householder. Of the households with income less than $30,000 a year, 63% were headed by a white householder in 2010. 60% did not work for pay. 54% were living alone or living with someone they were not related to. 47% owned the home they were living in, while 33% were headed by someone over the age of 65. Although almost half live in suburbs, they're more likely to be living in rural or urban areas compared to the national average. Very low-income households, those with less than $23,000 for a family of four, were concentrated in places like Mississippi, Texas, and South Dakota. I'm Katherine Mulbrandon. Please visit visualizingeconomics.com to see more infographics from my book, An Illustrated Guide to Income in the United States.